Welcome to Moo Moo Math and Science. In this video, I'd like to talk about types of solutions. And I'd like to talk about hypertonic, isotonic, and hypotonic. First, let's talk about a solution. A solution is a combination of the solvent and solute. The solvent is what dissolves, and the solute is what is being dissolved. In this cup of coffee, the water is the solvent, and the solute is the soluble parts of the coffee, the cream, and the sugar. Now, there's a relationship between the solute and the solvent. As the solute increases, the concentration of solvent decreases. And as the concentration of the solute decreases, the concentration of the solvent increases. So let's look at this blood cell. In hypertonic, it gets smaller or shrivels up. In isotonic, it stays the same. And in hypotonic, it gets larger. Let's see why. First, let's look at the hypertonic solution. This could be salt water. The solute increases, therefore the solvent concentration decreases. So water will flow from high to low. So there's a higher concentration of water inside the cell than outside the cell because the water is the solvent. So the water flows out, causing the cell to get smaller. In a hyper photonic solution, such as distilled water, the solute decreases, therefore the concentration of the solvent increases. Water flows from high to low, so it flows from outside of the cell into the cell because there's a lower concentration in the cell. And finally, with an isotonic, it is just right. There is an equal concentration of water inside and out so the cell remains the same. So there we go, three types of solutions, hyper, isotonic, and hypotonic. I hope this helps and thanks for watching. Moo Moo Math uploads a new math and science video every day. Please subscribe and share.